downtown San Diego. It's Mariners baseball. Hello, everybody. Welcome next. back to Hollywood Sports Entertainment. And you know what time it is, guys. It's time for some Sunday night baseball. On a fine night for baseball Hollywood Sports is back show. on the grind again, and guys. And I'm sorry about Thursday night football. I just thought Mariners. since everybody was watching, you know, a lot, a lot of Mad 16 videos from E3. I thought I'd just take a week off from Thursday night football. So if you missed it, I'm sorry about that. I should have let everybody know, but hey, it's time for Sunday Night Baseball, and we are playing in San Diego right now. You know, we're only five games out of first, but we're still under 500, but we're going to get this thing back on the road, back grinding. You see my man, his, 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 his shot show, Iwakuma, going against Brandon Morrow, and Brandon Morrow came out of Seattle, man. He was drafted by Seattle. But he never worked out, man. You guys will have much more to talk about as the night progresses. But first, let's have a look at the starting lineup for the There's a famous Seattle lineup. As they're starting nine tonight, they got Willie we'll Bluequist playing a lot of first base right now. That's because he's producing. They'll go to work against this man right here, as you see the numbers for the Cal Berkeley All right. hander Brandon Morrow. Like I'm a, I'm a, hey, in advance, guys, if this green screen don't work out, Sometimes the lighting has to be just right, and I'm recording in a place where sometimes I'm not getting a lot of lighting. So, uh, hey, if it works out great, that's good. But if it doesn't, you know why. There's that defensive lineup for San Diego. All right, what a beautiful night for baseball. Austin Jackson. All right, here we go. Let's go, Austin. We came to San Diego to play some baseball, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Boom. Oh, way to set on that pitch. Way to set on it. Inside. Brandon Morrow can't pitch. That's why Seattle let him go. What, what you doing, Brandon Morrow? What you doing? Austin Jackson going to put it in the field, baby. He's going to put it in the field. Here we go. Playing good baseball. Woo! First almost. Coming into clear Just a little focus. late. Just a little late. Get him, Jackson. Get him, Jackson. Here's the one-one pitch. And Ooh, inside. The inside corner, it's one Woo. Two. He tried that Bush pitch on the first pitch he threw. It was on the inside, but he missed it. He got that one though. Come on, Austin. Beautiful, beautiful night for baseball, baby. It will Here be night soon. Oh, yeah, no, nope, he ain't chasing that one. No, uh-uh. Good eye, Austin. Yeah, good eye, baby. That last swing, I would have thought they'd go right back in, but... Come on, Jackson. That's actually not a bad location because I doubt he was looking for something. Ooh, good shot, Jackson. There you go, baby. You got a bat on it. That's okay. He tried to sneak that fastball by you. All right, here we go. Come on, baby. Get Come on, get that good hit now. Here's the two and two home. Ooh, fall in, fall in. Ah, we couldn't get it. Couldn't get it, Austin. That's all right. That's all right, baby. So we saw the slider as he gets the fly ball there. But as for the rest of the arsenal, here you go. It's a look at the scouting report to see what else this guy features moving forward. His fastball goes from 91 to 96 miles an hour. And in here. One for four in See, look at Willie Bloomquist's game. numbers, man. Look at his numbers right there. That's why he's playing first base tonight. Against left-handers hitting 340. First pitch coming. Now a swing and a ball. Go in the crowd. Go in the crowd. Go in the crowd. Oh, good catch. Good catch. Here's that swing again. This is in show motion, and mm, you'll see that that's a few inches above the thumbs. You'll be feeling yeah, that. Yeah, he kind of chopped that in the air. He didn't really get a solid contact on that pitch. Here's my man Robinson Cano. Robinson Cano. Oh, that was the pitch to hit. Woo! Oh, Brandon Morrow's throwing across the plate though. Territory to retire the side. So a fairly painless top of the first. And now the Friars will get their first chance, no score. Oh. 
Ramiro Pena makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. All right, Iwakuma, let's get him, baby. First off, get him, Iwa. Get him, Iwa. Oh! First pitch of the inning is bounced up. Nice base hit. Nice base hit. A base runner rather quickly here as that's into center field for a leadoff single. Yeah, nothing too special about a ground ball single up the middle here, but if you keep putting the ball in play like they've been doing. All right, guys, let's get two, baby. Let's get two. We'll see if this gets them started. Watch my man on first. He's got a 50 rating speed. First pitch on the way. Breaking pitch, and this bounces in front of the catcher. Now, how important is it going to be for this guy to throw that curveball for strikes? I don't know that he necessarily needs to ever throw it for a strike. I mean, if it's around the plate and he's getting guys to go after it, it's doing its job. But if he starts to get too high or too far outside, then it's just an easy take. You got it. You got it. Ruggiano. He's not going nowhere. He's not tagging up. Shallow left for route number one. Good play, boys. Good play. And with the big lead, he can afford to take a few chances with that fastball. And here, this one works out for him because this is nothing more than an easy fly ball. He ain't going nowhere. He ain't going nowhere. Into the box, Brandon Morrow. Showing bunt here, but he takes ball one. And you know, I've always thought, if you're pretty sure a guy might be trying to bunt, then put that first pitch out of the strike zone. Make him show you his intentions. Maybe you get him to offer it something that he shouldn't. And they'll try and play for one here as he gets this one down. And he'll pounce on this quickly to tag him Good play, out. good play. Way to be alert, Cano. This is a nice job here. There's no way we could have got my man at second. Put this ball down it was a nice bunt by Brandon Morrow. But he put he put it right the down the first baseline, do baby. Tag on him, but hey, he gets the job done. Here's Yonder Alonzo. As this is pop foul behind the plate, it's strike one. But that was a really Two good sacrifice, but second. though, because he got my man in scoring position. As a look, now the pitch. And this is hit hard on the ground. That's all right. Line goal. it up. Line it up. Oh! In the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error. Good inning, baby. Good inning. Retired. A golden opportunity to get on the board. Here goes for naught. Don't go anywhere. More Tuesday Night Baseball after this. Five. Willie Bloomquist will come forward now. He has flied out. All right, Willie, let's go, baby. Now the first pitch. Swing and a ball hit hard on the run it out, run it out, run it out. And the good hustle, good hustle. With a ground out, one away. Now batting second baseman, Robinson Cano. All right, baby, we're in the top of the fifth. We win it. We stride in. We are winning this game five to nothing. Great stadium, great stadium. Here's the first pitch to him. Fastball too high to start him out here, one and oh. Yeah, that's a good spot to miss against a guy like this. He loves that pitch up in the zone. Most power hitters do, so that's not a bad idea to give him one above the letters. The next pitch. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. It's a ball and a strike. Looks like double barreled action now in the San Diego bullpen as they get a lefty and a right hander up to throw. Good hit, Cano. And that pitch is lined into left field, and he's got his second hit of the evening. Good hit, Cano. Well, even when you keep him in the ball. A nice display of hitting right there. Check it out. Here he's right on this pitch, and he smokes it in the left field for a beautiful, solid center. Beautiful hit. Come on, Cruz. Here's Nelson Cruz now. There oh. goes Cano. Pitch misses. Good steal, Cano. Good steal, baby. And he's in there easily at second. And even with a five-run lead, you've got to play with the mindset that no lead is ever That was a good safe. call by the coach, man, calling right for that steal. Being aggressive. Getting yourself in the scoring position. 
Nice steal. Nice steal, Kano. Beautiful. Fire and you know, Kano is not hits. known to be and stealing no bases, but he took advantage of it. This point. Cruiser waits the one up. Boom. And ooh, looked like a definite pitcher's pitch there on the inside one and one. Randy Morrow likes to pitch Cano, on the inside. That's stolen base number three here on the campaign. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. 1-1 one, one pitch on the way. Now a fastball that just misses here as the count moves to 2-1. And one. And I think that's He's been working a big that inside. Part of the problem so far. He just can't locate his fastball, especially in situations where he has to. That's why Cano put it in left field. One. Oh, still coming inside. Behind to him here, three and one. We and got Kyle Seeger on deck, baby. That this guy poses. So even down three and one, I can't imagine he's going to get. Don't even swing, Cruz. He might right even here. walk you. Don't even swing. Don't even swing. Three one on the way. Three and all two. right, all right. A dangerous spot for that one. Now, I don't think it was by design. It's one thing to miss your spots out of the zone, but when you miss in the zone, especially up, that's when you tend to get hurt. Three, two, here it comes. Oh, Cano, no. I mean, uh, Cruz, no, you swung at a bad pitch. Oh, that's a good pitch right there. That's just a heartbreaking slider down and away. And you get the hitter to be enticed by that. He got you to chase, man. He got you to chase. I was looking like it was going to be a fastball on the outer half. Then it just flat disappears on you. And you're left wondering, what happened? Now here comes Bud Black up out of the Friars dugout on his way to the mound. And he's going to make the move now, as that's it for Brandon Morrow. Odrisimer Despagne is going to take over here in inning number five. Odrisimer Despagne. Be to try and keep him in the game here. Whew. Not a bad ERA for three innings. Three strikeouts. Come on, Kyle. Bring Cano in, baby. Here's the third baseman now, Kyle Seeger. Oh, he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate with the fastball as he backs him off a bit. Whoa, there's that calling card right there. First pitch up and in. Y'all see that right playing in the background the right there? Wake up, everybody. There it is. And he Ooh, takes a nice pitch. One. Figure we'll probably see a heavy dose of that sinker here tonight. That must have been at the bottom really of the zone right there. Especially when wow. He that ground you call ball. that a strike. Even in situations like this where he's just trying to get ahead. Here's the 1-1 one, one pitch. Outside with the fastball as the count moves to two and one now. The two one. And this pitch is hit foul off to the left and out of play. So the count goes to two and two now. Here comes a two two. There you go, Seeger. Three balls and two strikes. Way to set on it, baby. He does have first base open, so he doesn't have to come in right here. He can try to make that perfect pitch, and you know what? If he misses, who cares? Three and two, here it is. And he stays alive as this is grounded foul. The next three, two. To right field. That's all right. Drink your liquids, guys. Drink your liquids. Waiting on it now is Kemp, and he puts it away to retire the side. Mariners leave one, but they hold a 5 nothing lead. The seventh. Matt Kemp will stand in, and he, like so many others, hitless in the ball. Iwakuma so is pitching a one-hitter so far. Now the first pitch. Swing and he takes this the other way. There you right. go. Good Cruz job. Is there one away. Good job, Cruz. Well, this is one of those situations where his guys got him the lead early on, and he's been in complete control ever since. I mean, he's barely been threatened out there. <laughs> first pitch coming. Carlos Quinn Beautiful. is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. Not too many strikeouts on the ledger for him so far, but it hasn't really mattered. 
Yeah, I think ideally you'd like to see him miss a few Boom. more bats, but as long as you're good pitch, good guys pitch. off balance and you're letting your defense help you, you don't need to strike a ton of guys out to be successful. Fouled back. Bases are empty, one man out. The 0-2 once more. The next 0 2 misses, and that'll move it to 1 and 2 now. And even though he's pitching well, this is a part of the order that he's really got to worry about. Now they can turn a good outing into you a bad one. You got him. He's going through. after it. To two balls and two strikes now. Yeah, that's a great pitch on 1 and 2. He started in the zone, and hopefully, you'll get that guy thinking he needs to protect. It turned out to be a good take. One out, nobody on. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. And a swing and a miss that time by Quinn. Nice, he's nice. Strikes for route number two. <laughs> this little four-game run they've been on, it's been a good one. But unless things change in a hurry, looking they like they won that four straight games. Right here. Well, it's time to get my loss right here, baby. Will Myers will step in now. He's bounced out and flown out. And his Ram is going to get back on a win streak. First pitch to him. First pitch of the AB is swung. Jackson got it. Jackson got it. Center. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching. For San Diego. Need to get it going soon. It's 5-0. Nine. Leading off for the Mariners. Mike Zanino. We'll get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the ninth. Come on, big Mike. Ninth inning begins as the first pitch is taken for ball one. Good job, Big Mike. The 1 0. Look out, 2 0 now. Well, not close on either of these first two. What's that guy's name? Quackenbush? You have to find the release point quick before Pitch the ball right, Quackenbush. The 2 0. And a ball popped foul to the right side. That's a right, good stroke. Player. He threw it to you. Hit it. If he throws it down the middle, hit it. Pitch on its way now to Zanino. Checks his swing, but this will be strike two. Oh. The 2-2. Two -two. Struck him out, but he'll try for first on the run drop it, third Run it, run it, Zanino, run it. And he saves yes. the first, so he's aboard Woo. on the drop third strike. So not the start to the inning he was looking for as he got the strikeout, but the runner reaches anyway. Hisashi Iwakuma will make a we got a break on that appearance one. tonight, and why not? He's been in command. Here's the first offering. This is lifted into the air. Out Iwakuma driving went deep. Myers is there, and he has it for the first out. We should have pinch hit for him. We should have pinch hit for uh, Ikuma. Hitter supply all the power himself. He gets good wood on this I'm going to see how many pitches he has. We might be having pitch Austin a complete Jackson game. We'll try again. 0 for 3 thus far. Now here's the first pitch. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Runners Beautiful on night for baseball. One down. Here comes the 1-0. And here's a ball hit in the air. Under it is Alonzo. Two away now. Willie Bloomquist will step in. One for four in the ball game. Willie Bloomquist. Here's the first offering. Swing and a liner, but foul. Come set, now the pitch. Oh, Willie, come on, Willie. Swing and a miss, strike two. And that's about where he'll sit with that fastball. 93, 94. 
That's you made a de enough. decision to swing guys, late. To. Come on, Willie. From the belt, the pitch. Swing and a ball bounced back up the middle. And he'll just step on second for the force, and that'll do it for this half inning. One left for Seattle. They're up five to one. Alexi Amarista will stand in to lead things off as All right, you will come. You only got seven, 75 pitches, baby. We're going to ride you. So let's close it out. Let's close it out. No hits between them. And you got to figure you're not going to win too many games when that's the case. And that'll be when your horse is running, near Glenn you keep him running, baby. Coach. When your horse is carrying a load, you let him carry the load. Now, pitch on the way. He had nice well slider, the nice slider. Line, but back into the crowd, foul. Let's throw him another one. The pitch. That's inside and low. It's a ball and two strikes. And that's a pitch you have to lay off right there. That tight slider busting down and out of the zone. All that can do is tie you up. Hard sinker misses. All right, come on, Iwakuma. Come on, baby. Throw me a strike. Put it in that mitt, baby. Put it in that mitt. There you go. Bouncer into no man's land down that third baseline. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Here's another 2-2. Two -two. Now a ball lined towards center field. And that's in there. Base hit. So that's just how you want to start it here in the bottom of the ninth. Matt Kemp will stand in now, and he's been kept quiet out of the number three hole, hitless in his three at bats so far. First pitch coming. And ah, you should have swung, baby. You should have swung that bat. Side corner. It's 0 and 1. Yet again, another first pitch strike. And it's a big reason of why he's having the success he is. You establish the count in your favor right away, and it just opens up the door to so many more options going forward. And this is hit. Oh, another hit. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And that runner will go no further than second as there are. Come on, Iwakuma. Oh, we got some life here now in the ninth inning. First and second now. And hey, one more base. You better get some out of this bullpen. Get him warmed up quick. We've seen stranger things happen. Let's get Fernando Rodney warming up. Come on, baby. Get warmed up. We might need you. Here's the first pitch. There you go. Side target here, and he there you go. Strike one. No strikes, He's baby. Working behind him, but you know this guy does not want to give up the baseball. And he never does. I just don't think that's in his mentality. Now action. Beautiful. As their closer Beautiful curveball. There. Donnie couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane to the plate, and that'll be ruled a strike. From the stretch. Slider, but that's low as it's dug out by the catcher there. Still now on one and two, you don't have to make the perfect pitch out there. The count is still well in your favor on the mound. Now the one two. Well hit high in the air and deep to center field. And this is taken in shy of the track, but the runner will tag from second. Oh, and the throw back in is a wild one. And as a result of that errant throw back in, he'll advance 90 feet here and move up from second to third. Will Myers will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Runners leap from first and third. Here's the pitch. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. The catch. The catch. Has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. He ain't going nowhere. And he'll think better. He ain't going nowhere. As he holds it third with two away now. All right, let's put him away, Iwakuma. Let's go, baby. Will Middlebrooks with the last chance now with two out here in the ninth. Now here's the first pitch. And that's in there for strike that's one. That's it, baby. Throw strikes. Another good pitch there. Uh, I'm not sure he's throwing a bad slider tonight. Every one of them has had a ton of movement. He waits. Now the pitch. 
Oh! He lays off for ball one. Not the first time he's felt the squeeze tonight. Yeah, he's looking and saying, what do I got to do to get a strike? Here's the 1-1. One -one. And this is fouled straight back. He had to swing at that, baby. He had to be, he, it, it, that I would have been a strike. The 1-2. And a bouncing ball, foul. Come on, you come on. First and third, two go ahead and throw one by him, baby. Let's get on the plane and go home. Throw it by him. Let's get on the plane and go home. A big pitch here, one and two. And he gets a He's hacking. Here as this ball is fouled away. He's working it up there. Come on, baby. Let's go home. Let's go home. Oh! Ooh, that was close. Well, you don't want to get caught looking on the final out. And he is not chasing. Pitch to lay off. Two two pitch on the way. And it oh, got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked the video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you're new to the channel and you want more and exciting videos from Hollywood Sports Entertainment, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button, guys. Hit that like button. Again, thanks for watching. And as always, until next time, everybody, I am Hollywood Sports. One more look at the final line score there to see the great pitching performance that led his guys to the victory. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, just the one run allowed, but anytime you can give your bullpen a day off, it does nothing but help your club in the long run. So that's a wrap here tonight. Eric Carroll, Steve Lyons, Matt Vaskersian, you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Facebook at MLB The Show. The Mariners win it 5-1. to one. Good night from San Diego.